I'm rubbing my I'm rubbing my mustache against the mic. Oh yeah, how's that working out for you? It felt weird. It felt weird. Well, welcome back to Hello. another episode of the dooms and glooms and things going boom. Like the Samsung Note Seven. <laughs> Let's <laughs> the, bring the that iPhone back. Samsung S Sam Note Seven. Yes. Thing. Oh, oh no! Jesus, you got fudged. I was not expecting that. <laughs> Hello. I had plenty of health, so I'm like, eh, I don't really. The guy really. to your left was like, hello, can I have a hug? <laughs> Let me hug you with my fists. Let me hug you with my acid. <laughs> no, the other one was shooting acid. Oh, was it? Yeah. Well, you died due to acid. Yeah, he got the final blow. <laughs> Kill, steal, and bitch. Um, Apparently had a bit of a jack, too. Yeah. Jacking off, just jacking it. <laughs> well, let's try that again, shall we? You know what? Have you ever... Ever felt like this? <laughs> How strange things happen. Are you going around the twist? Round the twist. Now, I do this strange thing. Exist? Well, that too. Existing in itself is a strange occurrence. It's when a mummy and a daddy love each other very much, and sometimes they don't even have to love each other. It could, be a, it could just be a one-night stand thing. <clears throat> and then you're born. But anyway, that's not the point. Do you have moments where you... Have characters in your head and you start playing characters in your mind. Yep. Like you try to make... I'll, it's like... I don't really have any that I could explain. Like, I'll talk as myself in my... This sounds like I'm fucking crazy. But I'll talk to myself in my head and then I'll think of other characters I could play in my head. Yep. Yep. Sort of like... I could be like... Here we go. I'll be racist as well. An African-American teen in the Bronx... And I'll like run that through my head and I'll go, okay, so this is that person. This is what my mannerisms would be. Or I'd be a Scandinavian chick in the middle of a nightclub getting, I don't know, drunk. I don't I like, know. I like that one. I want to meet that one. <laughs> you don't want to meet what's in my mind. And I just sort of like, it's interesting like how voice actors and improv, improvational, improv comedians um, have this amazing ability to on the spot create a character and I wish I had the, went really fucking quiet yeah I think all the demons died yeah not the demons in my soul which is not a bad thing really what the demons dying not necessarily wait <laughs> yes also yes yes like I don't know why I thought of that I was just thinking like because I run a um, you, a D and D game, and like I'm there. Yeah, you are there. You won't be this time because someone has to work. A, A, B, B. Fucking who's playing D and D today? Me. Yeah, I get to be my ranger. Speaking of which, um, did you know the uh, ranger had an upgrade? I did hear about. Did that. you just kick that guy through a wall? I did. <laughs> Fucked his shit up. Slow mo replay. Fucking oath. Goodbye. Um, so they've changed a bunch in the Ranger. Anyone that likes Dungeons and Dragons, I would recommend reading through it. Especially if you run a Ranger in a game. Have a look, because it is fucking insane. So, you know the Rogue's passive ability for get for the bonus action? Yep. The Ranger gets that through leveling up. Oh, cool. The Ranger also has an, initi an advantage on all initiative rolls. Oh, really? Yeah. Excuse me, guys. There's three mind. new conclaves. There used to be... Jesus, did you just rip him in a new asshole? Yep. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Nothing like ripping yourself a new asshole in the morning to make yourself feel like a man. Um, I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> I'm also confused. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus, you just got football tackled across the room. Hello. He's teabagging you now. He was not happy about what um, I did to his friend. <laughs> so there's... Originally, there was like... In Dungeons and Dragons, you every class has like a subclass to it. Yep. Like you can pick one side or pick another side. The Hunter only had two. Beastmaster mm. and Hunter. They've introduced a third one where it's sort of like you live in the Underdark and you learn the ways of the drow. Oh, okay. So you get all like the drow magic, like darkness and binding and all that sort of stuff. Cool. You also have advantages on all your sneaks and all that sort of stuff. So, the other cool thing about it is, too, is um, you also have this ability um, 
if you choose beast, which I probably will end up having to because I'm running a beast master, so I have to take the um, beast conclave. Um, your monster now attacks on its own. Oh, okay. So if your monster is within range and sees you attack, it can use its reaction to attack as well. That's cool. So instead of you using your move, your um, your attacks for it to attack, you can make it attack for itself. That's cool. Which makes being a beastmaster more viable. You also, it's just read it. I would recommend if you like Dungeons and Dragons. I know, nerdy. Believe it or not, we're nerdy. Um, Who to thunk it? Yeah. Uh, the other, the reason why I brought this up, Dungeons and Dragons as well. Besides the hunter, have you been watching Stranger Things? No, but I hear I hear it's apparently bringing D and D back. I well, D and D's been back for a while now. You know this, right? Yeah. Um, it. I watched the first ten minutes of the first episode. Yeah. It is actually an interesting show. Um, I've heard it's good. <laughs> let me in. No, let me in. No, he's mine, Bob. No, he's mine, Steve. <laughs> I like how Steve's a character in our in our thing now. Steve's just a Steve character. Steve is our improvisation. Yeah, our first. I think our first improv character that we've made. I think so. Yeah. And um, I like he pops up in everything we do now. <laughs> I think the best one now is uh, our D and D game. Yeah, in our D and D, we've got a sword named Steve. I don't know why, but because Gary and I got to name <laughs> it, Gary joined in on the joke. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, my name is Steve. Oh, God. I love that sword. <laughs> I just like... That character pissed me off. Steve. Yeah, but uh, just part of our history now, I suppose. I think now you... I think it's... I, th I think now it's grown on you a little. <sighs> not heaps, but just a little. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Did not see you there. That's when you need fucking the predator. Click, 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 click. Fucking... You scared the bejeebies out of me, sir. Bejeebies. Fucking... Bejeebies. Oh, I can't lock on because it's fucking invisible. Oh, that's... Oh, it's cloaked. Well, yeah. But I was trying to fucking lock into it. <laughs> lock it in, like, Eddie. Lock it in, Eddie. I'll take your blue key card, sir. It's blue. da ba dee a ba die ba da ba dee a ba die a ba dee a ba die I'm a-saying, I'm a-saying. <laughs> what? I don't know. <laughs> Thank you. Fucking doors take a long time to open these days. But, uh, a secret found. Yeah. Look at that fucking little chip there. Fucking You're doing that. actually well this session. Oh, shit. And I think I spoke a little fucking too soon. That's right, I got this. Oh, mate. Oh, oh what? Oh, oh, oh. I think you just killed yourself. I can't kill myself, though. Can you not? I got the thing to fucking... Um, the perk. To not be destroyed by my own stuff. I'm perky. Speaking of perky. What? Christy Mac. Well, her face isn't perky anymore. No. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> I came in like a war machine. <laughs> Did he never get that hit name so War Machine hard? from the Marvel hero? I don't know. Or is it because he comes in like a war machine? Probably because he comes in like a war machine. What type of war machine do you reckon he is? Um, Hello, um, Revenant. We meet again. Uh, you win. <laughs> <laughs> I think you won that. Ooh, there's he... <laughs> Trapped against the wall. I think he was posing. It's a beautiful <laughs> pose. A five second photo shot. Um, is that hard? Are they? Turn around. Look up. No, no, no. Turn left. Oh, I thought there was a love heart on the top there. They're just like L's. Blue oh. L's. L K K L. Fourteen. It means something. What do the letters mean, Mason? So this was really an area full of nothing, really. Well, oh, we'll see if you can get that red key card. Oh. And. Mega uh, health. Overshield and all that sort of stuff too. Where the fuck are you? I don't know, but it seems very cold. Well, I was ready for a cold reception. Oh, there's more fucking platforming. Oh, is that a dude guy? Hey, doom, doom guy. guy! Hey, little doom guy! Fucking have not found many of them. Cyber Mancubus model. I don't think I can go anymore. You can go back up. Yeah, maybe. Fucking. Is that where you're supposed to go? Oh, no, there's a hole here. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where, where did, did you come, come from? Cotton Joe. Out my penis. Out my penis. 
Because that's where you come from, my penis. That's right, everybody comes from my penis. Okay, so... It's the clones of Hitman. Hitman's a good guy. Is he? No. <laughs> I was going to say, I don't <coughs> think so. Oh, okay. When is the next yeah. part of Hitman coming out? Um, well, there was one episode that came out just recently. America's coming out soon. America. Probably, probably the end of this month, I think. Oh, yeah. Uh, you've got... Um, this month being September? Yes. Would it be September or would it be... Still September. October? Still September. I believe. Would Just. it be still September when this comes out? Just. Possibly. Mate, Maybe. Good job. <laughs> yeah, fucking. Fucking roundabout. Hey, look, BFG bullet. Damn, Skippy. You um, ever think, what made these demons so angry? Fucking. Uh, you ever think maybe they had a fam they've got a family? <laughs> See, that's the things I like to think about in these sort of things, like the bad guys' families and stuff. Like, you know. Well, you never think about the henchmen, do you? No. You just um, needlessly kill them. Like, what happens if you go home? Like, you're the son of a henchman, and you know, it's the only thing they know to do. Um, and you get a call in the middle of the night, your dad's dead. All yep. because the good guy. Wouldn't that drive you to want to be evil? Oh, yeah. I think that uh, I think that needs to be addressed in uh, <laughs> in both video games and movies. Wouldn't that be an interesting turn of events? Like a game built on you being the child of a henchman that's got killed, which turns you to be evil. So your whole pl plot is to get revenge on the good guy. So something like the Nemesis system in Lord of the Rings: Shadow of Mordor, sort of thing. Yes and no. Like like that was a good idea and everything, but. Like, just a revenge type thing yeah. of it would be a fantastic idea. Well, it's idea. like the whole... A lot of people want to play the bad guys in video games. Oh, yeah. Is there any video games out there that you play the bad guy? Um, I'd say maybe Overlord. I think you play the bad guy in that. Yeah, that makes sense, because you punch around minions, don't you? Yeah. Um, but that's, that ends up becoming an RTS, does it not? Yeah. Yeah, very much so. So I'm not interested. Anyway, um, so... Evolve? Uh, one, one person plays the bad guy? <clears throat> yeah, I'm talking more like... Single player. Oh, uh, yeah. See, single player is probably not really the... Th the th Everybody wants to play the hero. I want to be the enemy. Yeah. I want to be the bad guy. That's I want to be Lex exactly Luthor right. to be Superman. That All would right. be cool. We'll finish this off in the next episode. So thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Like and comment and shoot the demon in the face. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Man, I am flying through it. I mean, seriously, I want to be the bad guy. Being the good guy's boring. Who wants to be Superman when you can be Lex Luthor? I guess you're kind of the bad guy in Hitman. Not necessarily. You're I mean, you a, are a bad guy. Not necessarily. You're just, just paid to kill. Just doing bad things.